Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir. Hurriyat leaders and organizations have strongly condemned the Modi led Indian fascist regime for renaming schools, colleges, roads, and other historical buildings and places to completely snatch away the Muslim identity of Jammu and Kashmir. The leaders and organizations in their statements in Srinagar said that Modi regime was living in fool's paradise if it thinks that it can change the dynamics of Kashmir dispute and force the Kashmiris to desist from pursuing the legitimate struggle for freedom by renaming historical places after Hindu leaders. APRC leader Khaja Firdos deplored that the Hindutva government was also rechristening important Kashmiri places after the killers of innocent Kashmiris to humiliate them. In one such latest move, the regime has renamed a government college in Kolgam after a notorious police officer involved in the killing of dozens of Kashmiris extrajudicially. He asked India to read the writing on the wall and pave the way for peaceful settlement of Kashmir dispute. Meanwhile, five more Indian Central Reserve Police Force companies have been deployed in Srinagar to man every street, land and by lane in the city to brutally suppress the demand for freedom. The troops occupied school buildings and marriage halls in civilian areas for accommodation. Posters were pasted on walls, pillars and electricity poles in different areas of Jammu and Punch to pay tributes to the Jammu martyrs of November 1947. Communist Party of India Marxist leader Mohammad Yusuf Tarigami in a statement said the authorities' decision to shut down internet sporadically in Srinagar and other areas of the valley has brought back painful memories of communication blockade imposed by Modi regime on August 5, 2019. The second phase of a referendum for an independent Sikh homeland started in London today. The first phase was held in London on 31st October, while in over 30,000 Sikhs took part in voting in a massive show to support a separate homeland. The next phases of the referendum events would be held on 14th and 21st November in different cities of the UK. The Sikh referendum will also be organized in the US, Canada, Australia and the region of Indian Punjab. The findings of the Khalistan referendum will be shared with the United Nations and other world bodies to seek support for Sikh homeland. Political experts said that Sikh referendum in London is considered to be a defeat for Modi-led India as it has failed to prevent it despite exhausting all political tactics.